హలో కిడ్స్ శుభమంగళం ఎట్లీటిల్స్ కాలర్ హై స్కూల్ వైస్ ఎఫ్ మిస్సెస్ నర్సీనా టేకింగ్ స్టాండర్డ్ ఫస్ట్ స్టాండర్డ్ ఫస్ట్ సబ్జెక్ట్ ఇంగ్లీష్ స్టాండర్డ్ ఫస్ట్ సబ్జెక్ట్ ఇంగ్లీష్ వీ ఆర్ ఇన్ లెసన్ నంబర్ టెన్ ఏ అండ్ ద వీ ఆర్ ఇన్ లెసన్ నంబర్ టెన్ పేజ్ నంబర్ ఫార్టీ టూ ఏ అండ్ ద ఇన్ దిస్ లెసన్ వీ ఆర్ గోయింగ్ టు లర్న్ వెన్ టు యూస్ ఏ వెన్ టు యూస్ అండ్ అండ్ వెన్ టు యూస్ ద ఎస్ ఇన్ అవర్ ప్రీవియస్ క్లాస్ ఆల్సో ఐ హ్యావ్ డిస్కస్ దిస్ when to use a and and when to use a and and how many vowels are there children we have five vowels how many vowels five vowels what are those a e i o u are what five vowels a e i o u come on say a e i o u a e i o u are five vowels see a a T E I O U are what five vowels leaving these five vowels we have in alphabet in a b c d alphabets how many letters we have alphabets we have 26 alphabets how many alphabets we have 26 out of the 26 a e i o u five are vowels a e i o u five are vowels and remaining 21 letters remaining these are five remaining 21 letters are known as consonants remaining 21 letters are known as consonant now a is there yes in vowel b is there no b c d yes e is there f is not there so like this whichever words are whichever letters are not there in vowels remaining those words are known as consonants okay we in english alphabets we have 26 letters out of this 26 five are vowels what are those five a e i o u are five vowels remaining all letters are known as consonants remaining all letters are known as consonants so in front of vowel word we use a in front of consonant we use a now see this we use a before a word that starts with consonant w e v u s e use a b e f o r e before b e f o r e before a w o r d word t h a t that s t a r t s starts w i t h with c o n s o n a n t consonant c o n s o n a n t consonant we use a before a word that starts with consonant consonants are 21 a e i o u are five vowels leaving that five letters remaining all letters are known as consonant so in front of consonants we use a in before a word that starts with consonant before a word that starts with consonant we use a now suppose c a dash c o i n coin dash coin is the word naming word okay coin is the naming word in front of coin now you should add a coin or an coin <coughs> which one is correct a is correct and is correct to see that first you should see the first letter yes what they told before a word that starts with consonant before this is the word yes and the word is starting with which letter here c the word is starting with which letter c now you should see that c is consonant or vowel in a e i o u you have c in a e i o u you have c no we don't have c so it is a consonant so you should have it right a coin understood before a consonant word you should write a yes now b e d bed b e d bed dash bed now see check the vowels a e i o u in this a e i o u you have the first letter b here you should see the first letter the word starting with which letter the word starting with which letter here the word is starting with b letter here the word is starting with b letter so in, in vowels a e i o u you have b no we don't have b that means it is a consonant it is a consonant so in front of consonant we will write a what we will write a 
नेक्स्ट डैश आईसी आइस डैश आइस डैश आईसी आइस आइस इज ए वर्ड ओके आइस स्टार्ट विद विच लेटर आइस इज स्टार्टिंग विद आई लेटर आइस इज स्टार्टिंग विद विच लेटर आई लेटर नाउ सी इन वर्ल्स यू हैव आई A E I yes we have I in vowels yes A E I yes we have I in vowels that means in front of vowel word you should write and that's all very easy in front of vowel word you will use and in front of consonants you will use a now you will say an ice cream what you will say an ice cream O W L owl. O W L owl. So first you should see the word is starting with which letter? The word is starting with O. The word is starting with O. Now see vowels. Read out the vowels. A E I O. O is there? Yes. In vowels we have O. In vowels we have O. So this word is a vowel word. So we should write an. Understood? In front of consonants we will use a. In front of vowels, we use an. Is it clear now? <coughs> w e v u s e use a n an b e f o r e before a w o r d word t h a t that s t a r t s starts w i t h with v o w e l s vowels. So we use a before a word that starts with consonant. We use an before a word that starts with vowel. Come on, say we use a. We use a before a word that starts with consonants. Consonants means leaving a, e, i, o, u. Remaining all the letters of alphabets are known as consonants. Okay, like b. C D E we have vowel F G H S I we have in vowel so leaving that five vowels remaining all the letters are known as consonants so how many consonants we have twenty one consonants and five vowels so we use a before a word that starts with consonant next we use am before a word that starts with vowel now we have Use a or an with this naming words. Now take your grammar test book, page number forty-three. English grammar test book, page number forty-three. You will do along with me. Yes, copy it along with me. Now you can see here. Yes, a coin. Yes, why we are saying a coin? Because it begins with c. C is not a vowel. C is a consonant. C is a consonant. So we use a coin. Next, b i c y c l e bicycle. So first letter of bicycle is what b. First letter of bicycle is what b. Now b we have in vowels a e i o u. You have b no. So it's a bicycle. So what we'll say a a bicycle and an apple means when we are talking about any one thing. When we are talking about any one thing, then we use a r and a r and. When we are talking about one person, one thing, one animal, so we will say a r and. Now book, b o o k book. Yes, dash b o o k book. Now say for what is the first letter of this word b. Now check whether b is present in vowels a e. I O U B is there? No, B is not there. So what should come here? A R N. Now this is a consonant. So we will write A before a vowel and before a consonant A. A book means one book. When we are talking about one book, one pencil, one chair, we use A R N. Yes, A R N is used when we are talking about any one person, one place, one animal, one thing. Okay. Now place means dash far. Dash park. Dash park is one park. We are talking about one park. Dash park. So what is the word? First letter of the word P is the first letter of the word. Yes, P is the first letter of the word. Now check whether in vowels we have P. A E I 
O U P is there in vowels? No. P is not there. That means it is a consonant. It is a consonant. So in front of consonant, we will use A. Understood, children? In front of vowel and in front of consonant, if in A E I O U, suppose say dash elephant E L E P H A N T elephant. Now, what is the first letter of this word? E. What is the first letter of this word? E. Now, see in vowels we have E. A. E. Yes, E is present in vowels. Yes, E is present in vowels. So, now it is a vowel. Yes, E is a vowel. So, what will come here? A or an. Yes, an. We should write an. An elephant. A park. That means we are talking about one place. One animal. One place. One animal, when we are talking about any one thing, one place, one animal, one person, we use A, R, and. We use A, R, and. Now, see your test book. Page number 43, see this. And ice cream. Why we wrote and in front of ice cream? Because I. First letter is I. I we have in vowels A, E, I. Yes, vowel word. So, we write and. And egg, E, G, G, egg. E is the first letter. In vowels you see E is present. A, E, yes, E is there. So, and, and ice cream and egg. Now, test book page number 43, A bit, we will finish. Yes, I have written already A and B questions on the board. When I am writing answers, immediately copy it in your test book. Is it clear? A and B, page number 43. U, S, C, use. A, O, R, or A, N, and W, I, T, H, with T, H, E, S, C, these, N, A, M, I, N, G, naming, W, O, R, D, S, words. Use A, R, M, with this naming words. All these are naming words given. E, A, G, L, E, eagle, name of animal. Eagle, name of the bird. Yes or no? E, A, G, L, E, eagle. All these are naming words given. Naming words of people, places, animals are things. Eagle, name of the bird. I, N, K, ink, P, O, T, pot. I, N, K, ink, P, O, T, pot. Ink, pot is also name. A, R, R, O, W, arrow. Bow and arrow. Yes, bow and arrow. K, I, T, E, kite. You all know kite. O, W, L, owl. Bird name. P A I N T E R. Painter. Painter means one who paints. One who paints is known as painter. B O A T. Boat. We can see boat in sea, no water. S P A R R O W. Sparrow. S P A R R O W. Sparrow. Name of the bird. U M B R E L L A. Umbrella. U M B R E. Yellele umbrella. Umbrella is the name of the thing you, we use when it's raining. Now, in front of this, now we should add A, R, and. What we should add? We should add A, R, and. Yes, to add A, R, and what we should do? First, we should see the first letter of the word. First letter of the word. Yes, E, A, G, L, E, eagle. E, A, G, L, E, eagle. E is the first letter. E is the first letter. Now, how many vowels we have? Five. How many vowels? Five. What are those? A, E, I, O, U are five vowels. A, E, I, O, U are five vowels. Yes. Now, E, A, G, L, E, eagle. E. What is the first letter here? E. So, now see E is there in vowels. A, E. Yes, E is there in vowel. So, what will come here? A, R, N. It is a vowel word. E is a vowel letter. E is a vowel letter. So, what we should write? An eagle. What you should write? An eagle. Understood? Because E is vowel. E is vowel. In front of vowel word, we use an. What we use? An. Here, see, we use A before a word that starts with consonant. We use an before a word that starts with vowel. So, all the vowel words we use an. Okay. So, eagle. E is the first letter. In vowels we have e. Yes. So, we will write an eagle. That means one eagle. This all we are talking about one only. One person, one thing, one place or one animal. An eagle. Now, dash ink pot. Dash ink pot. 
What is the first letter? First letter of the ink pot is I. First letter of ink pot is I. Now see in these vowels you have I. A, E, I. Yes, I is there. Yes, I is a vowel letter. So what will come here? Vowels means what you should write? An, an ink pot. What you should write? An ink pot. An ink pot. Now next. A, R, R, O, W, arrow. A, R, R, O, W, arrow. What is the first letter of arrow? A. What is the first letter of arrow? A. Now, C in vowels you have A. Yes, A. Yes, is a vowel word, vowel letter. So, in front of vowel letter, what we should write? An. In front of vowels you write an. In front of vowels we write an. Next, dash, K, I, T, E, kite. K I T E kite. What is the first letter of the kite? K. K is the first letter. K is the first letter in kite. Yes. So now C in vowels you have K. A E I O U. K is not present in vowels. So it is a consonant. A K is not in vowels. That means it is a consonant. So in front of consonants, what you are, what you should use? A. So it is a consonant. It is a K is not present in vowels. It, that means it is a consonant. In front of consonant, we write A. A kite. Understood? These vowel letters are there, means you will write an. If it is not a vowel letter, then you will write A. Next. Dash O W L owl. O W L owl. What is the first letter of owl? O. Now see, do you have O in vowels? A, E, I, O. Yes, O is present in vowel. So, what should come here? A vowel or an, an owl. A owl or an. O is present in vowel. So, an. What should come? An. An owl. What should come? An owl. Next, dash. P, A, I, N, T, E, R, painter. P, A, I, N, T, E, R, painter. What is the first letter of painter? P. What is the first letter of painter? P. Now see in vowels you have P. A, E, I, O, U. P is not there. That means it is a consonant. P is a consonant. So in front of consonant what you should add? A, R, and. In front of consonant A. If vowel letter is there, and. Very simple. If vowel letter is there, and. If it is not there, A. So in vowels you don't have P. So you should write A. A painter. A painter means we are talking about one painter. Dash. B O A T. Boat. B O A T. Boat. What is the first letter of boat? B. B is the first letter. Now C in vowels do you have B? A E I O U. In this do you have B? No. B is not there. That means it is a consonant. It is a consonant. So in front of consonant what you should add? A. What you should write? A. If it is there, vowel letter, then and. If it is not there, A. Yes. Next, dash, S-P-A-R-R-O-W, sparrow. S-P-A-R-R-O-W, sparrow. What is the first letter here? Yes. What is the first letter? Yes. Now, see in vowels, do you have S? Yes? A-E-I-O-U. S is there? Not there. That means it is a consonant. So, in front of consonant, you should write? A, A sparrow, A sparrow. Next, dash, U, M, B, R, E, L, L, A, umbrella. U, M, B, R, E, L, L, A, umbrella. So, what is the first letter of umbrella? U. What is the first letter of umbrella? U. Now, see in vowels, do you have U? A, E, I, O, U. Yes, U is present. So, U is a vowel word. So, in front of vowels, what you should write? Yes, A N and A N and I hope children you understood now when to use A and and in front of consonant letter you will use A in front of vowel letter you will use and we will read this and we'll go to next one an eagle an e a g l e eagle an eagle an ink pot an ink pot i n k ink p o t pot an ink pot an arrow, A R R O W arrow, an arrow, a kite, a kite, K I T E kite, an owl, an owl, O W L owl, an owl, a P A I N T E R painter, a painter, 
a painter and owl a kite a painter a boat a b o a t boat a boat a sparrow a sparrow s p a r r o w sparrow a sparrow an umbrella an umbrella an u m b r e l l a umbrella an umbrella now finish that a one in your test book now we will go to b one fill in the blanks with a r n here also same thing using a r n here only words here only words are given here the sentences are given yes these are what eagle ink got arrow all these are words only words what are these all these are sentences six sentences how many sentences we have six all these are what sentences sentences means all the words put together put together to form a meaningful sentence a r u n s aruns put finger and see a r u n s aruns m o t h e r mother g a v e gave h i m him dash s h i r t shirt aruns mother gave him dash shirt yes here also you should use a r n immediately after dash which word is there after dash we have shirt after dash we have shirt what is the first letter of shirt yes what is the first letter of shirt yes now c in vowels do you have yes a e i o u s is there no s is not there that means s is consonant so in front of consonant what you should add use a in front of consonant a in front of vowels and so this is consonant s is consonant so you should write a shirt now read arun's mother gave him a shirt next t h e r e there i s is dash t a r k park n e a r near m y my h o m e home t h e r e there i s is dash p o n d pond i n in t h e the p a r k park now immediately after the dash you should see the word this is dash after dash you have park after dash you have park so what is the first letter of park p what is the first letter of park p now see in vowels you have p a e i o u no p is not there that means it is a consonant so in front of consonant what we should add a in front of consonant what we should add a now next there is dash pond you should see immediately after the dash after the dash which word is there after dash you have p o n d pond so what is the first letter p what is the first letter p p is present in vowels a e i o u p is present no p is not there that means it is a consonant so in front of consonant what you should write a what you should write a now read there is a park near my house there is a park near my house there is a pond in the park so there is a park near my house i in the park what is there one small pool pond i h a v e have dash g a r d e n garden i have garden i t it h a s has a main why many p l a n t s plants to write a r n you should see the next letter after dash after dash which word you have after dash you have g a r d e n garden after dash you have g a r d e n garden what is the first letter of garden g what is the first letter of garden g now see whether g is there in vowels a e i o u no g is not there that means it is a yes consonant so in front of consonant what you should write a i have a garden it has many plants i have a garden in that many plants are there o n e one d a y day dash a n t and w a n t e d wanted t o two d r i n k drink w a t e r water i t it w e n t went t o two dash p o n d pond in this we have two dashes one day dash and 
After dash, which word you have? After dash, we have a n t n. After dash, we have a n t n. In that, which is the first letter? A is the first letter. Which is the first letter? A. A is the first letter. Now, see in vowels, you have a a e i o u. A s a is there in vowels. So, in front of vowels, what you should write? A n n. A n n. One day, an ant wanted to drink water. It went to dash pond. So, after dash, which word you have? P O N D pond. So, what is the first letter? P. What is first letter of that word? P. So, P is present in vowels. A E I O U. P is there? No, P is not there. That means it is a consonant. So, in front of consonant, what you should add? A. You should write in front of consonant. What you should write? A. Next, one day an ant wanted to drink water. One day an ant wanted to drink water. So where it went? It went to a pond to drink water. Dash dog was sitting on dash apple tree. Dash fifth one. Dash dog was sitting. S i t t i n g sitting on dash a p p l e apple t r e e tree. Dash dog. After dash, which word you have? D o v e dog. D o v e dog. What is the first letter? D. What is the first letter? D. Now see in vowels. Do you have D? A e i o u. D is there? No. D is not there. That means it is a consonant. So what you should write? A. Why we are writing capital A? Because it is the first letter. We are starting with the sentence is starting with A. So A capital A. A dog was sitting on dash apple tree. Dash after dash which word you have apple. After dash which word you have a p p l e apple. So what is the first letter A? What is the first letter A? Now see in vowels do you have A? A e i o u. A is there. That means it is a vowel. So in front of vowels what you should write an. A dog was sitting on an apple tree. Next. I W E N T went dash. I went pet. I want W A N T want. I want a pet mongoose. I W A N T want a P E T pet. I want a pet mongoose. I W A N T want dash P E T pet M O N G O O S E mongoose. I want dash pet. After dash, which word you have? P E T pet. After dash, which word you have? P E T pet. What is the first letter? P. What is the first letter? P. Now see in vowels you have P A E I O U. P is there? No, P is not there. That means it is a yes consonant. So what you should add? A. A pet mongoose. I want a pet mongoose. Come on, finish it in your test book. What is your homework? Your homework is. A and B you will write in your classwork. H W homework. W R I T E write lesson ten. A B B I T S bits in C W you will write these two in your classwork. Is it clear? These two bits you are going to write in your class, okay? And be immediately now complete in your test book. After that, you will copy and write it neatly in your class work. While writing in class work, you will open your mouth and spell each and every word. Once again, shall we read these sentences? See, put finger in your test book. Fill in the blanks with A R N. A R U N S Aruns. M O T H E R Mother. G A V E Gave. H I M Im. A S H I R T shirt. Arun's mother gave him a shirt. Next, T H E R E there. I S E S. A P A R K park. N E A R near. M Y my. H O M E home. T H E R E there. I S E S. A P O N D pound. I N in. T H E the. P A R K park. There is a park near my home. There is a pond in the park. Hi, H A V E have. 
A G A R D E N garden I T it H A S has M A N Y many P L A N T S plants I have a garden it has many plants next O N E one D A Y day A N and A N T and W A N T E D wanted T O two D R I N K drink W A T E R water one day and and wanted to drink water and and means here we are talking about one and only A part means here we are talking about one part A I N is used when we are talking about any one thing one person one place or one animal. I T it W E N T went T O to A T O N D found A D O V E down W A S was S I T T I N G city O N on A N and A P P L E apple T R E E tree A down was sitting on an apple tree I W A N T want A P E T pet M O N G O O S C mongoose. I want a pet mongoose. Now take your classwork and immediately copy A and B very neatly in your classwork when you are writing. Touch the lines. Write lesson number, page number, heading, and write it clearly. When you are writing, uh, when you are drawing lines, underline it on the red line only. Don't do it on the blue line. It will be look. It will be neat when you are doing it on the red line. See, I did not touch the word. I did not touch the word in the same way. You should do it on the red line. Do it neatly. Write neatly. Okay, a bit uh, five one side and uh, four one side. You can write and this also you can write in the same paper. Do your work neatly when you are writing. Open your mouths. Read everything. Whatever is written on the board. Now you should be able to read. Spell each and every word and write it very neatly in your classwork. Thank you, children.